daggers, practice touch and go landings. clear the flight deck and move all incoming aircraft to the hangar deck. surface-to-surface -surface guided missile and a sidewinder air-to-air -air missile. One of the most intricate seagoing operations is started as the destroyer Gaiot eases alongside to refuel. The hoses connecting her to the forest all deliver fuel at the rate of 2,000 gallons a minute. Against air attack, the Gaiot is armed with Terrier missiles, which have proved their efficiency against high-speed target planes. Transfer of personnel is accomplished during refueling operations. Refueling operations are a must regardless of high seas and heavy winds. In spite of adverse weather conditions, the destroyer Charles Ware is refueled with efficiency and dispatch. Ware is a wet ship during this operation, but to the crew, it's all in a day's work.